you know, you're failing your grade, your, your tests, you're, you're failing your um, lab exams, and it's just not looking so good for you. Um, I just would not, I wouldn't get discouraged at all because I was never a very successful student. I was, I'll be, I'll admit I was very mediocre. I got really down myself and I, I wasn't getting good grades and everything, but I always had fun in the kitchen. So I never stopped having fun. I never stopped loving it, but I felt like it was a reflection on me because we were in this very formal setting and you're getting tested every other day. And I, I just looked at myself and I said, you know, maybe this isn't for me. Maybe I'm just not cut out you know, everybody's doing so well here. I just don't understand, you know, what I'm doing wrong. But that's not the case. I finished culinary school and I haven't had a problem in the kitchen. You know, I I feel like it's just some sometimes people aren't good with academic things. That's all. I'm just I don't feel like I'm good with academic settings. But uh, it's definitely a down and I would not put yourself down about it. I would just keep going, get your degree and get out there and just prove what you can do. So you think that culinary school, or did you find it harder than you thought it was going to be when you first started? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. I thought I thought it was going to be so easy. I'm like, oh, we're going to go in here. We're going to be baking all day. We're going to be eating like stuff all the time. We're going to be dining and, you know, having a little class where you set up and put down stuff. But it's it's very strict. It's very regimented. And it's, it's great because that's the way we need to be. But it's not what I expected at all. I didn't expect it to be that way. But I'm glad that it was. It really prepared me for the real world and professionalism. Um, But I thought it was it was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Absolutely, with the the classes and everything, you have to take nutrition classes. You have to take food and beverage management classes. You have to know the math and the you know the professionalism. Everything. There's a lot that goes into it. 